Here's a trick if you're going to spend big money on a cable about which one to actually buy. The one I recommend spending the big money on is the very first cable that connects from your guitar into the pedal board. This is the most important because it's being driven by passive pickups in most cases. Unless you happen to have active pickups, then you can disregard everything that I'm saying here. The reason why that first cable is so important is that our pickups are not very efficient at being able to drive any capacitance on the output, so changes in the cable types will make a huge difference in the overall tone, and that cable is going to have the most influence of any cable on the entire rig because it's not getting low impedance feeding it. This is where you want to start to experiment with different cable types, different brands, different lengths, to see not only what length works for you when you're on stage or in whatever environment you're playing, but also to see how it affects the capacitance of the overall system, and by choosing different cable brand manufacturers, you get to see what your ear is attuned to and what you prefer most to kind of shape the overall tone for the rest of the rig to then be encompassed under.